You guys want to get your that red blood, American red blood flowing. Yep, that'll do it. That'll do it. Yep. One of my favorite shows. What is the greatest lesson that you've learned? It's a broad question, right? Mm -hmm. The greatest lesson? <laughs> my dad would say, don't eat yellow snow. Can we do dad jokes on here? <laughs> uh, <laughs> the greatest lesson I've ever learned, I think about your great-grandmother's great-grandmother a lot. What do I mean by that? What was her name? You don't have to answer, this is rhetorical. Was she happy? Did she shoot somebody? Did she pay her taxes? Was she loving? We don't know anything about her. Mm -hmm. My point to that is, we matter for this long in this world. So why not spread joy and love with the people around us instead of being uh, so, this world is so negative. We want to judge others. We want, we want to feel better by hating on others. That needs to change. Yeah. And so my point about your great grandmother's great grandmother is that she mattered, her hopes and dreams, um, everyone has those. And so we matter for very long and I hope it gives people reason to, to maybe be happier. A little and, more zen. A lot more zen. Can we have a lot more, please? Mm -hmm. I, I think we need it. This world, um, the, the past year has proven um, what's important to a lot of us. And I think our investor world, we look at everything as transactional. I put this money in, I get this money out, boom, boom, boom. Mm -hmm. What I'm talking about is something different. It's relationships, but it's also something that's uh, sustainable for the next 10 to 20 years. Gotcha. And what is your favorite, best, or most interesting failure? Hmm, which one? Got plenty of those. I know, you gotta pick one. Okay, most interesting. Um, I already talked about the Lamborghini house where I lost a couple hundred grand, so that's just money. That's replaceable. Mm -hmm. um, in the early 2000s, I bought a domain name. It was pimpmyride.com. <laughs> there was a small TV show. You might have heard of it uh, yeah, around that I same time. Yeah. And about a million and a half people a month would go to the site. I didn't capture one email. <laughs> I didn't put hardly any content. I just put, it was called Google AdSense at the time, AdWords AdSense. Yeah. So people would show up there, they'd go, uh, click, and I'd get paid, mm -hmm. thinking it would always be that way. I didn't push that traffic to another site. So in spectacular fashion, as the Google slaps and things changed over time, uh, Viacom ended up taking the site. I didn't get sued, but they took the site through a trademark, mm -hmm. and I didn't fight it because uh, as my trademark attorney said, you're a kid and they're Viacom. <laughs> <laughs> I thought that was pretty true. Like, okay, we don't need to worry about that. And so, yeah. um, you were a squatter. Well, I owned it. I know. And but it, they called them domain squatters. Yeah. And yeah. And though it's funny, their trademark is for Viacom's pimp. My ride was what it was called. And I'm like, well, wait a second that, you know, it's like one of those things like, well, maybe I could, but here's the thing. Um, at that point in my life, it wasn't the fight I wanted to have. So right. it's a spectacular, you know, had I taken that traffic and pushed it to Phil's deals on wheels or something, you know, mm -hmm. I might've had something sustainable, but life is ever changing. So try to embrace it. I think. Yeah. I love that. Is there a book you've gifted more than any other? Uh, the big rich it's called, it's about the, how the oil industry has shaped our country. Mm -hmm. Um, you talk about true entrepreneurialism when you're digging in the dirt and you fail over and over and over again, uh, trying to find that oil. Gotcha. Have you watched um, The Men Who Built America? Oh, well, I'll, sadly, I've probably watched it four or five times. Yeah. I've recorded them and saved them. And if we're ever in the mood, I love to play them. Uh, yeah, I've seen it multiple times. Yeah. I mean, for you guys that are, are listening to the show, if you guys want to get your, you know, that red blood, American red blood flowing. Yep. That'll do it. That'll do it. Yep. One of my favorite shows. Yeah.